absolutely took a square and then wound up to uh, kick the, the ball. Nuts. Well, pain. Mm. Mm. Oh, I knew that hurt. I've felt pain. He's felt pain. I know that, that hurt. Let's, let's, ooh! Pain. I've felt pain. He's and the crazy felt, thing is, the crazy felt, thing is, some of y'all don't know this pain, pain. because y'all are iPad felt kids. Pain. That dude's felt pain. <laughs> what? No, I haven't felt any pain. Emotional damage. Now you felt pain. God, overkill, bro. We've all felt pain. <laughs> you know what they say. The only things truly guaranteed in life is it's death taxes. and pain. <laughs> Wait, death and pain. What about, what about taxes? Wait, what? Is this what did I say? For real? No, what did I say? Be all controversial you gotta here, pay your taxes. Pain? Th that shit hurts, bro. Specifically, no, dude. the little shit that just does one damage has no business hurting so bad. Like stubbing your toe or biting your tongue or, or fucking paper cuts. Like that shit shouldn't even hurt, bro. It's paper. It's not scary. Biting your oh, tongue? Shit, I still oh, my remember gosh. the first time in my life Terrible I ever pain. took some real damage and felt some real pain. And it was What'd back you do, when Chase? I was four years old. Which, man, I was still learning the controls of life old? and shit. Like, yeah, I could run, but it was low-key like watching a dude play Fall Guys. If he was drunk <laughs> and yeah. fried and asleep. But oh, crossfade. One day I was bored doing four-year-old shit, and then I seen my arch nemesis. Oh, fucking shit. Oh, I was like, is it and fade I on sight? I instantly knew what had to be done. I had to assert my athletic dominance by running that chair's and jumping ass? over this chair. Oh, so this I can't go well. Deep breath. This can't go I run well. up, jump, and clear this chair clean as hell. Oh, now, sure. Now, keep in mind, I was four years old, so that was probably, that was probably the coolest shit I'd ever done in my entire life. So the wildest part about this is like four years old, man. I I don't think I have any memories from when I was four years old. I think the only memory that I have from four years old, and I probably told this story before, but I'm gonna tell y'all again because you know, <laughs> I have bad memory, is when I was in pre-K, that was like four or five years old. Man, man, I used to have the baddies trying to get me to, you know, cuddle, not cuddle with them, but sleep, th sleep near them during nap time, bro. Y'all remember nap time, man? I had every girl asking me, oh, are you going to sleep next to me during nap time? Are you going to sleep next to me during nap time? I'm like, okay, ladies, like, <laughs> there's enough for me to go around. Like, y'all, you know, you, you go ahead and grab a number. I'll get to you in a bit. <laughs> I, was, I was pulling them from a young age. From a young age. I, I know my dad was happy. He didn't have to worry about his son being gay. <laughs> well, you know I had to show my mom to make her proud of the man I've become. Hey, mom, watch this. <laughs> What what the hell are you doing, Chains? Hey man, just watch. Oh, and you about to learn. bust ass in front of your mom? Oh, oh she's never gonna let you have fun again. I fucking ate it, bro. Like that was Woo! the type of pain that hit so hard you can fucking taste it. And damn, Tasting that, shit that pain. tasted ass, bro. Like, have you ever taken a soccer ball straight to the schnoz? Cause that shit will have you smelling pain. <laughs> what about the nuts? And seeing tears. <laughs> the nuts which is, is way bad, worse. <laughs> but like, who the fuck invented the funny bone, bro? Cause that shit ain't funny. Like, bro, you can't just call some pain flash shit funny and expect it to be humorous. No, no, no. The bone is called a humorous. Yeah, shut up. How we all took anatomy. Yeah. Humorous. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah. In fact, it's not I humorous, it's the is opposite it? Of humorous. Like, yo, did you guys know one in four dudes is gay? Hey, yo, is that true? I sure hope it's Owen, because he's sexy as hell. Yeah. He's the gay one. <laughs> yo, that's the funny bone, too. Yeah. <laughs> if I had a pain tear list that went from shit ain't nothing to I'd probably rate hitting your funny bone a solid. Mm. It's the same as stubbing mm. your toe real hard. Like, you just need a moment That's to a take mm. a few deep breaths and say a few slurs, and that shit just heals itself. But if we're looking at some top tier, what is the worst brutal, pain? Some agonizing, gay hit in the nuts gotta be on top. Pain, getting kicked in the ball. What did I say, bro? What did I say? There is this like old debate that goes like um, which one is more painful, childbirth? Or a man getting hit in the nuts. I don't even know why I had to put man. What other person has nuts? But which one do y'all think is more painful? Obviously, I'm a little more biased. I think getting hit in the nuts is more painful. But I know I have all these girls, these the three women who are subscribed to my channel, throwing their fists in the air, angry, yelling at their computer screens, saying, Prince, you're so stupid. Childbirth is way worse. And there could be good arguments for it. Because like you're pushing a watermelon through the size of like a pinhole. It ain't a pinhole, but you know what I'm trying to say. So there can be arguments 
for childbirth being the worst pain, but getting hit in the nuts, oh, I would not wish that on my worst enemy. But do you know what hurts even more than getting hit in the nuts? Emotional pain, bro. <laughs> I still think about her to this day. <laughs> now for you 19.8% female audience, I know you might not be able to understand what this feels like. So let me just give you a quick overview. Imagine having balls, overview. right? Now imagine <laughs> getting kicked in them. That shit hurts like a... I mean, they can't imagine it, can they? I remember one time in grade Y'all ever imagine having a vagina? a good old game of soccer. And we were I playing kept that with to the myself. big homie. <laughs> I mean the really big homie. Like the dude had more chins than a Chinese phone book. Like last time we went to a restaurant, <laughs> that was funny. looked at the menu and said okay. And I couldn't even tell he you said how big okay. he really is. Cause last time he stepped Give on it the all. scale, it I said want it all. one at a time, please. So what I'm trying to say is he was a big dude. And he big was a thick dudes boy. He's got big legs, and big legs produce hard kicks. And during Very this hard kicks. soccer game, I unfortunately found myself leg spread away. Oh. Oh, no. Freshly dropped testes exposed oh, to this absolute. You took a square in the wound up to uh, kick the, the ball. Nuts. Well, pain. Mm. Just pain. Hey. Followed by a moment of silence from everyone on the field. And I don't know if the moment of silence was for me yeah. or for my next generation of kids. The because you can't have kids, bro. Wiped out, but I <laughs> felt that shit. And I felt it in my stomach. You are and there sterile was really now. Only one sound I was able to make in that moment. <laughs> <laughs> That's how it be, bro. You don't wanna... <laughs> now, I don't know what a lot of you guys are thinking. Getting kicked in the balls is nothing compared to childbirth. childbirth what did I say? Is so much worse. This guy's a massage. It's like I can see no, the future. I don't give people massages. And I might be the first to tell you this, but I've experienced both getting kicked in the balls and, and childbirth. childbirth. And really? honestly, childbirth wasn't even that painful at all for right? us. Right? Like, they just complaining. It was, it, it was probably a little worse for my mom. So ah. like, <laughs> now, we all know physical pain very well, but what do you call that Emotional. deep, torturous pain Emotional you feel pain. when your dog dies? In Minecraft, that's that psychological pain. Like emotional the pain you feel damage. When you're a banger YouTube video and an ad interrupts you out of knowledge. Or like the pain you <laughs> feel when you just got done making some toast and peanut butter and that shit flops on the oh, floor of your face. That's first. happened to me before. Physically, I want. I want to. I just want to fight somebody afterwards. Like there really is levels to this shit, bro. Cause now when you start adding psychological pain onto the physical pain of things, mm. we gotta start adding new tiers to this tier list. Cause it all right, y'all, let me know in the chat. Let me know in the chat. What is the worst emotional damage that you have been through? I'll say for me, it was when I was in the sixth grade. And I don't think I've told this story before, but essentially me and like this girl, like I used to pass notes like back and forth. Y'all remember note passing? Y'all probably don't because y'all have phones and y'all can text in class. But back in the day before, you know, everybody had phones and when teachers really did take up your phone during class, if they saw you texting, you used to pass notes. You know, you write on a piece of paper, you pass it to the girl, and then she writes, and then she passes it back to you, so on, so on. So essentially, there was this girl I used to pass notes with all the time. I had the biggest crush on her and everything. I wanted her so badly. And then one day, like, she passes a note to me that says, I like you and I want to be with you. I, I want to date you. Something along those lines. And I'm, I'm over here, like, teeing, like, yeah. I'm so giddy, bro. Like <laughs> the sun is shining, the grass is green, I'm smelling the roses. It is nothing can ruin that day. Until something ruined that day. Apparently, like it was just a prank that her and like a couple of friends, like, you know, they got together and decided to prank me. So yeah, she didn't really like me. And then like when she passed me that no, like, you know, I started uh, professing my love for her. I was like, oh, I've always wanted you. I can't believe you feel the same way. And then she tells me it's a prank and she feels bad and I didn't talk to her for like a good two days. And then she had me back. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I was simping over her. I was simping, man. But yeah, she pranked me by saying she likes me back. That is emotional damage. Imagine peacefully sleeping in your bed and you get woken up to the pain of your girlfriend kicking you in the ball. Why would she do that? Hurts physically, but then you realize you don't even have a girlfriend. Ooh. And, and you live alone. <laughs> so just to knock a few more off this tier list, uh. a scooter to the shin. <laughs> Stepping on Lego is a solid. Mm. Now getting okay. soft in the face is an interesting one, cause that shit can range anywhere from 
all the way to yeah. get the sonic ring shot. It just depends where they hit you, man. Good enough punch, you might not even feel anything. I got punched once. For the, I didn't feel I it. I would say that's the shit where you just take one damage. Built like eating tough. some food that's too hot or getting a brain freeze or, or when you're laying in bed with your phone you drop and that your shit phone. slaps you across yep. the face. Like they it's slaps just mine you. is one HP and, and mine is five IQ. <laughs> and if anyone's seen that shit, it's probably a lifetime dead of aura on the <laughs> people stack. For something Minus to be in the aura. shit ain't nothing to your, it's terrible. just gotta be a good ass day, bro. Like some days I'll just be feeling invincible, bro. Like wake up, roll out of bed. Wait. Waking up sexy as hell. Eat a All nice right. hot breakfast. Go do that. Stub my toe while simultaneously getting socked in the face. Shit ain't nothing. <laughs> Get a bad phone call. Oh uh, yeah, Chains. This this is Doctor D's. Um, I'm sorry to break the He's news. Nuts. To you, but, uh, you know, you tested positive for chlamydia. Hey, man, shit ain't nothing. <laughs> Just oh, give me shit, the antibiotics, yeah, uh, man. I'm good. Uh, you also tested positive for herpes. Oh! Herpes, gonorrhea, hepatitis. Herpes never goes away. On your Don't shit. give me that. Honestly, at this point, our best bet is just to chop that thing clean off. Uh, what? <laughs> Yeah, if you shit, chop my penis off, no, yeah, no. just no, kill me. Something. We're, we're chopping your meat off. Yeah, no, bro. just kill me, bro. bro it's just like... <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, no, nah, that's it. I quit. I'm done. I'm going to sleep. Good night. <laughs> I, mean, I know this might sound like some freaky ass shit, but I feel like some pain low-key feels good, bro. Like in school, I used to... <laughs> How many freaks are out there? Show yourself. I know y'all are hiding, but this is a safe space. This is a safe space. You can be honest with me. You can be honest with me. How many of y'all men out there like being slapped? Or women? You know? It's okay. Like, this is a safe space. We don't kink shame on this channel. If you like being slapped, choked, all of those kinky stuff, very kinky stuff, how much of y'all know? Um, maybe just a little bit freaky at? Oh, oh, that's freaky. That's freaky to you? Boy, you do not know freaky if being slapped is freaky to you. I personally don't like it. It's not for me. I don't like being slapped. I don't like being choked. I don't like being... No. I do the slapping and I do the choking. All right? Get it, get, get it right, man. I always put the front chair legs on my feet just to feel the pain. Or even like eating some spicy ass food or like... Oh, yeah. Or, or like getting spanked. <laughs> Uh, yeah, no. Here's a freak no, right there. Nah, nah. I was thinking some more like like taking a really hot. But he gotta match my like, 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 <laughs> Okay, yeah. No, Yo, he's George, a freakazoid. Up, bro. I'm trying to make a video. And Sorry, shit. my fault, pimp. My that's fault. A, right. That's a real gooner. Um, what about what about when you like uh <laughs> getting slapped in the face? Bro, that's shut that's, the that's a gooner. Hey yo. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right. That was pain. Be like, and pain really do be like that. So yeah, let me know in the comment section below or in the chat the worst pain that you've ever been been through. And also let me know, do you think emotional pain is worse than physical pain? Because man, sometimes, sometimes emotional pain can just take you out.